tell me about uh, tell me about, about give me the give me the pitch for pulse x what what, what is it pulse x is like uniswap which is an on-chain exchange it just has lower fees and uh there is an address which could, if it wants to or not, do coin burning. But since you can't have expectation of profit from the work of others due to U.S. security laws, you can't have any expectations of it. Maybe just watch it and see what it does. Um, right. And then, so it's like Uniswap. It's an on-chain exchange. No counterparty risk, no middlemen. You swap one thing for another thing. And then on uh, Pulse Chain is a fork of Ethereum. It's just, it gets rid of the environmental waste. It doesn't do proof of work. It doesn't have to blow up the environment. It doesn't have to pay for environmental waste. So it has less negative externalities, better price performance. It doesn't inflate to pay for the waste. It only has deflation. It has coin burning built into the protocol. Um, burns 25% of the fees. Has higher, you know, faster, better, all that stuff. You can use the test net right now, yeah. play around with it. And then, uh, yeah, so. Our fork of Ethereum is called Pulse Chain, PulseChain.com, and our fork of Uniswap is called Pulse X. And then, you know, Hex, you're going to have your stakes on two chains now. So if you have Hex now, you're going to have it on the Ethereum chain, you're going to have it on the Pulse Chain. If you have Hex stakes, you're going to have them on both. And so it's the, the kill shot here is that we incentivize people to bridge in their ERC20s from the Ethereum network into Pulse and pair them with their free PRC20 copies that they got for free. And that acts as a liquidity pair. And then as people trade either side of it, they make fees and they also make an incentive reward token on top of that. And so when people back up the value of all the stuff they got for free, it that's what makes it all work. Because if you just make a copy of a thing and there's no liquidity and there's no price bonding and the prices don't move up and down at the same time, you know, you don't have a derivative play in all the value of Ethereum. So whether whether projects like our system or not, you can speculate on the value of mainnet Ethereum things on this side for much cheaper. Because look, right now, people today were paying two, $300 to do a Uniswap trade per trade. It's unreasonable. They're paying 20 to $40 to send an ERC-20. It's unreasonable. It's not supposed to cost more to send an Ethereum transaction than a bank wire. That's the opposite of why we're here. We're here for increased efficiency, not decreased efficiency. We're here for lower fees, not higher fees. So I hope that Pulse Chain can reduce Ethereum fees, make it more useful, and make the world a better place. Like it, it's just so many good things, better for the environment, free money. It's just awesome. Yeah.